Hey guys, welcome to the channel once again. Today we just barely finished installing the uh, the over fenders. You want to call it over fenders, or you want to call them fender flares? You know, in the uh, in the Yamaha page, it says over fenders, so we're gonna call them over fenders. So we just barely finished um, installing them. They look nice. You can see it's very, very easy to install those. I mean, you have to drill and that's the only problem that you might be scared of drill, but um, it's very easy. Let me show you. <clears throat> like I said in the last video, first thing you gotta do, you gotta take this, this, uh, this factory screw right here and then install this one first because that one already comes uh, pre-drill. And then you have to do the same thing for the back. So they all, <clears throat> these ones right here are the ones that you have to, uh, take it as a guide once you do that one you just press up in here make this one or this one either one and then keep going and then it's really easy now this one i didn't put it in the last video but today i install it anyway so it, it's kind of sturdy it's better and i put it through the uh let me show you it's a plastic right here i don't know if you can see it right here is this plastic let me show you yeah this plastic that comes from the factory i just put it on top and i just drill through so so that's the uh that's the uh the installation of the fender flares uh i like them or no i mean i really like them I like them from the side like if you see it from here it looks pretty cool but the problem is if you see it through the front because right here as you can see it makes the uh it makes the tire look skinny <laughs> and don't get me wrong those are big tires but uh but the fender flares or the over fenders make the tires look a little bit skinnier so that's the only the only caveat the only problem that you can see it from the front as you can see right here it makes the tires look a little bit skinnier but other than that i mean we're ready for mudding i mean i hope these things uh help us with the mud and keep the mud out and um next we're gonna install a uh, a hitch receiver we're gonna install the launcher the uh the rear seat and last but not least we're going to install a winch right here at the front so that's the only three things that uh that are left to do um and uh what else can i say uh I mean, this Kodiak 450, it's been fun. It's been a, a hell of a fun quad. And uh, yeah, me and my son, we're having a lot of fun. I just replaced the air filter and uh, and we have we're going to replace the oil uh, uh, in the winter because uh, right now we just barely changed it a couple of months ago. So yeah, I mean, if you follow the channel, you already know that uh, we are, we've been doing the, the build of the bike, but uh, thank you guys. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next video. The grill, everything looks good on that, uh, on the Kodiak. I mean, it's looking nice. I mean, I, I like it. Don't get me wrong, I like it. I love it. It's just this right here. When you step right here, and you step back a little bit, that's when you see the, the skinny tires. But uh, other than that, I mean, it looks cool. It looks good. It looks cool. It looks good, okay? So thank you for watching guys and I will see you in the next video.